Now in the previous episode we discussed how we created the retrieve doc node and we also saw in action that how uh, the, this retrieve doc method pulled the web content and then created a vector store and then we uh, passed the question into this vector store and we got only the relevant documents. So that was in the uh, previous episodes. Now in this one we're gonna create another node. So this uh, node we're gonna name it create model and by the name itself it is pretty obvious that we are creating the model here so I previously explained that I will not create the model again and again and the model will be used at or will be used by multiple nodes and I don't want uh, my program to create this model multiple times whenever I go into a node with all the configurations. So what I want to do is that I want to create a separate node that will gonna create a model and it will gonna save that created model in my shared state that is in the graph interface and that will be used by all the different nodes or it will be used across the entire graph flow. So let's create this model first. Okay, I'm gonna create an OpenAI model here with the temperature. So I'm gonna setting the temperature zero. I don't want uh, the results with a lower probability to come up here. That's why I'm creating the temperature. I'm setting the temperature to be zero so that only the obvious content or the high probability content comes up, right? And I'll be using the very default model name, which is basically the GPT-4. I guess that's the default model which I'll be using. I have set my temperature here. And at the end, since my model is created, I want this model to be saved and to be used uh, in all the nodes across. So I'm gonna just save it in my shared state. So I am getting the shared state here. I just want to save this in my shared state. So I have a model um, field here. So I want to save my model here. So instead of just doing model model, I'm gonna keep it as it is. It's a shorthand operator kind of thing in TypeScript or in JavaScript as well. And this will gonna return an updated state with this newly created model. 